Thank you for choosing Nasa Touch. Once you receive the Nasa Touch and your medication, the following steps will be helpful when using your device. Make sure to always wash your hands before handling your device and medication. Hands should be washed with soap in warm water for at least 30 seconds and dried thoroughly. Open the Nasa Touch box. Remove the instructions and all the parts from the plastic bag. You should have the following parts. 1. The charging station with nasal adapter compartment. 2. The irrigator compression body. 3. The nasa chamber. 4. The blue atomizer. 5. The separator. And 6. Three rubber tipped nasal nose pieces. One small, one medium, and one large. You will receive your medication in a separate box, and each box will have a label with storage instructions on it. For example, store at room temperature, store in refrigerator, or store in freezer. Setting up the Nasa Touch. Step one, make sure to charge the main unit for 24 hours prior to the first use. Step two, Place the blue atomizer into the nasa chamber on the side that is marked with a line and the word MAX. Step 3. Place the medication chamber onto the main unit and turn it until it snaps into place. The nasa chamber has two separate compartments, the medication chamber and the collection chamber. Step 4. Take one vial of your medication. Twist the tab at the top of the vial to open. Pour all of the medication into the medication chamber on the side marked with a line and the word MAX. Each vial is pre-measured. If all of the medication in the vial is not used, you will not receive the proper dosage prescribed by your doctor. When using multiple medications, be sure to use the antifungal last. Step 5. Place the cover with the raised dot facing the same way as the MAN symbol on the medication chamber and press down until it is in place. The cover will only fit one way onto the medication chamber. Step six, place the nasal nose piece onto the cover and press down until it is in place. Using the device. Step one, place the nasal nose piece inside your nostril and press the button for five seconds to dispense the medication while gently breathing in and pressing down on your other nostril. Step two, Switch to the other nostril and repeat step one. The total treatment time should be 30 seconds, five seconds at a time on each nostril. Do not reuse the liquid in the collection chamber. Cleaning the device. Step one, remove the nasal nose piece and place it in the bowl of warm, mild, soapy water. Step two, pop the separator off the nasal chamber and pour warm water into the side marked with the max line. Place the separator back onto the device. Press and hold the blue button for 5 seconds. Step 3. Remove the separator and the blue atomizer, placing them in the bowl of warm, mild, soapy water. Twist off the nasa chamber, discarding the excess water if necessary, placing it into the bowl of mild, soapy water. Step 4. Rinse thoroughly and place on a clean paper towel to air dry. If the nasa chamber is clogged, soak it in warm soapy water for 20 minutes and rinse. Do not clean the nasa chamber with vinegar and water. Do not place the nasa chamber in boiling water to clean. Do not take the base apart. Step 5. Once all parts are completely dry, store in a Ziploc bag or in a plastic container. Be sure to place the main unit back onto the charging station until next use.